Why were we so afraid of piranhas when we were kids? They're like quicksand. When did we think we were going to encounter these horrific terrors? But I still think about them from time to time, so I did some research this morning to allay my childhood concerns. Here's what I learned. Maybe it'll help you too. First off, they only live in South America, so most of us can feel relief that they're not out for our blood. Or if they are, they won't be able to locate us. But they aren't, I'm led to believe. Like most fish, they're supposedly skittish of us. We're too big for them, usually. Also, they're actually omnivorous. So while they are adept predators, they actually are going to eat whatever's available, which isn't a human, usually. Do you like those two usuallys? Ominous, huh? Well, those are there because they do eat humans sometimes. Fewer than 500 people a year, but that's not nothing. In one article, the author was trying to convince us that they're not that dangerous, but then she describes their, I'll just read it, razor-sharp interlocking teeth that are perfect for shearing and tearing flesh. And then she summarized her description by saying they have a devastating chomp. Okay, I had intended to relieve my childhood fears and... Maybe yours too, but I think we should maybe hold on to them.